this game is going to really go well for the Denver Broncos. And the opportunities were there many times. I'm on the first four drives. They took the ball. They made big plays. It's like, wow, this offense is on fire. But they made mistakes. Gary Kubiak did the only thing he could do. Shake the team up. The easy way to do it always is with the quarterback. Especially, especially when the quarterback is made and ready to bring it in. Anderson, that's going to close it out. Picks up the first down. And now you can pretty much lock it up for the wild card round on the AFC side. Pittsburgh at Cincinnati, Kansas City at Houston. While Denver will be the one, New England the two. Those two will be the one and the two and you know either one two or two one for the four straight year. Those those two, New England and Denver both get buys. That's right. And you know this this is last thing, the running game. You said it. I said it. Forget the Peyton Manning throwing, which was very good today, but the running game, what he did for him, is part of the story. Well, the story of going into the playoffs now becomes all about this team and number 18. Look, this is a Super Bowl caliber winning football team when you look at Denver. Peyton Manning is, is healthy, which he looked like he was. The defense, they can be in the city park. Hey, there were many people who thought we'd never see him play again. And now he's going to ride into the playoffs, and he's got his team back. And he's got his team now going into the playoffs with home field advantage throughout. Yep. What a story going into the postseason. See, there is no story bigger than that one. See the smile on his face. What a difference in the feelings it must be from him when he walked into the stadium today and when he walks out. And John Pagano almost fights with him, the D coordinator, Mike McCoy, who said many times how much he's a coach, how much he learned from Peyton Manning. He was his coordinator, Peyton's first year here in Denver. And there's Philip Rivers, two gentlemen right here meeting at midfield. And if it is it for the Chargers representing San Diego, they once again absolutely left it all here today, trying their best to 